Um, hi, everyone. I wanted to share with you a trick I found out on how you too can share across all of your Facebook pages and share to Restream and to every other YouTube, um, Instagram, whatever, all of the platforms you want to go to. So the main idea here is that you can share to both Restream and to as many Facebook pages as you want. Um, in the Twin Cities, we have 26 Facebook branch pages. And so when we use OBS streaming straight to Restream, it's great, but we end up having a social media specialist on our team who shares all of our streams on all of the pages twice a day. And so this is a huge pain. And I calculated how much time it was for an entire year. And we were looking at like over seven and a half grand to have her do this um, with her time. So we found a way to avoid doing that. So when your fitness trainer or whoever, your chef who's cooking, whatever they're doing in live streaming at the Y, um, they can use this method so that they stream to all of your Facebook pages. They cross post at the same time. They don't have to worry about it. And it just starts. It takes a little more effort, but um, once it's set up, it's very easy to do. Um, okay, so to do this first, make sure before you, I'm not going to show you how to do this, but make sure you allow your main Facebook page um, to have the ability that you're streaming from to share and cross post um, to all of your other branch pages. This is something you have to do ahead of time before you do this. Um, it's in the cross posting section of Facebook, um, but go into your settings and allow permission for your other branch pages to cross post between each other. Okay, so once you do that, you want to go into your Facebook Live API um, section. And to get to the Facebook Live API, uh, I'll just start from scratch here. So here's my personal Facebook page. And you can start from your personal Facebook page to get to your company one. But you click Live Video, and they'll take you on desktop to this new page. Um, but what you're going to do first is use your stream key. And I'm not showing my stream key here, but I have persistent stream key showing. So that way I can come back. It's not a temporary key. It can be reused every single time I go live. Um, and um, the only downside is you can only broadcast one live video at a time with your persistent stream key. So if you have multiple people doing streams, um, have them use, uncheck this box and have them use whatever stream key this is in OBS. So you can't see mine. I have it hidden or blurred or something. I don't know what I did in editing. Um, but you're going to take that and go into your settings. And in your stream, you're going to make sure in OBS that your service is Facebook Live. Um, and you're going to put in that stream key right here. And you're going to hit OK. Now, how uh, this is a great start. How do we get to restream though now? Because typically, when you're doing this, you look in your settings and you go to stream and you use your restream.io RTMP and you put it there so that you can go to restream. Well, you're going to actually have restream be sent from your recording. See how it says start recording down here? If we go into our settings, I found um, this really great site. It was like in a comment in a forum somewhere and I've never been able to find it again. It was a, it was like a mystery moment. Um, but if you go to your output tab and then go to recording, um, and once again, I'll blur some of this, but you need to copy these exact settings that I have here. Um, I don't know why. This is just what I was told to do. And so I did it like a foot soldier, but this works. So you're going to use custom output. You're going to output to URL, which is going to be your restream stream key. And what Restream is going to do is they're going to have a very specific stream key for you. And to get this, you have to paste this. You're going to use this URL, this basic URL at first, and then you're going to go into your Restream account. And so I'm opening mine up here and your Restream stream key that you'll paste at the end of that backslash is right here in your streaming software setup for RTMP. It'll be on the right side when you get in um, under next to your destinations. Take this stream key. You'll go back into OBS once you have these settings done and your file path or URL will be here. We have everything set up. 
So what does it look like in actuality? We have our streaming connected to Facebook Live and we have our recording connected to Restream. We're gonna hit start streaming, okay? But we're not actually streaming yet. Um, you will see that some things are happening down here. That's great. Um, but let's go into our Facebook Live API. Look at the bottom right here. It's showing that my my recording's going, but I'm not actually live yet. So over here, I could hit go live and I would start sharing to my timeline. But we wanna share to pages we manage. I can start selecting which page I'm gonna go to. So I'll just use um, Elk River right now as the main. But you're gonna notice that I can also cross post to more pages and all those pages are gonna come up that I am allowed to cross post to. So you're, this is what your fitness instructor would do. I'm gonna go to Andover and Blaisdell and Burnsville and, and normally I would select all of them, but let's not do that right now. Um, let's just, let's. I'll do one more why. I don't wanna do this to all 26. Maplewood Community, save. And so now it's going both to Elk River and um, Maplewood Community. And I'm going to say, uh, this is a test. Hopefully no one's on our Facebook and they probably are, but I will delete this very quickly. Okay, so now I've done my due diligence. I'm gonna hit start recording now and let's go to Restream to see what's happening. It's actually connected to my YouTube. Um, we're gonna turn off the YouTube. Uh, but so this is, now it's on my Twitch, which by the way, I have no followers on Twitch. Um, I know I look like I'd be a Twitch nerd, but I, I'm not. Um, but it's currently sending data. Now, I wouldn't actually start streaming yet because I'm looking at Restream and it's saying sending data and so it's taking some time. Um, you're gonna wanna add some type of countdown anyways, so this won't be a huge issue. Um, you'll add like a 15, 10 minute countdown at some point um, to your streams, but it takes a little bit for it to catch up. Now, if I go to my Facebook, um, I'm gonna go live here for a little bit and then I'm gonna shut down some of this recording so I can delete these posts, but we're gonna put these on Elk River and um, and we're gonna put these on Elk River in the Maplewood Community Center. Now, if you also uh, look inside of Restream, don't forget to update any titles uh, as, you're, as you're streaming. Don't forget to do any of this important stuff. Everything's set on Restream, we're all, we're all good to go. Um, let's do it. Let's go live. It's the the key key moment here. Um, we are live right now on these Facebook pages. Now you'll notice on the screen right now it's still loading. I don't think we're actually streaming. Okay, so the API is telling me that I am live now. Um, we are doing a test right now for a live streaming. Um, example video for the YMCA's across the country. So if you're watching this before it gets deleted, congratulations. You are making it just in time before we pull this down. Um, I... Hello, how are you Marietta? Are you having a good day? <laughs> I hope you are. Um, it's a very uh, it's a very crazy time right now, but um, I, hope you're, I hope you're doing well. Uh, anyways. I'm going to end the stream now. Very nice to chat with some of you. Um, I hope you enjoyed my pink and purple room here. Um, live streaming is so fun. Once you get started, you can't stop. Um, <laughs> I had 23 people watching me for that test, which is insane. Okay, so there you have it. Um, there is a way that you can stream across multiple branch pages and a restream at the same time. Um, I hope this really helped you guys. Uh, it's always fun to stream. It's always fun to jump into this stuff. So I hope that you have a great experience as well um, when you are streaming next. All right, take care. Bye.